Howdy who, quick video for you. So, um, the code's 0236, so my car chucked it up. What's my car? 2000 and, uh, 2002 uh, Volvo C70 uh, 2.4 turbo convertible. Um, so it chucked up the 0236 code and the car, and that was the, the engine light came on and, and that was the code that came up. So it was, the car was rough idle. It would, um, you would turn it on and the car would just, uh, the idle would just jump up to like 2000 and it would just come back down. It would, it would, it would flutter like this and, it would, and you'd take it for a drive and it would kick like crazy. So I came back down, parked it up, um, jumped online, found out, and then all I had to do was replace that. So that there is a map sensor. Now some people were saying that's the MAF sensor, which is the 0236 code. I don't believe it is. I, I looked online, um, quite a few websites, and that was the MAP sensor, which is the manifold air pressure sensor. Now some people say this is the turbo boost pressure sensor. They may be, they may be like, there may be two sensors inside this one unit. So, and don't get this confused for the turbo boost control valve. So, if your 0236 um, code is, is chucking up, then time for you to replace this component. So that's the map sensor. Um, what did it cost? Well, I got these off AliExpress for 10 bucks. Um, I'll, leave, I'll, even, I'll leave a uh, link in the, in, the, um, in the low bar. So, there you go. So just in case you were not sure whether or not it was the turbo boost control valve, um, or you know, someone's, someone's, someone's saying to you, it's the turbo boost pressure sensor, I think. And don't quote me on this because I'm actually not sure. But some people told me that there's two things in this one unit. I don't know. But if, if you're not sure, maybe this video can help you out. But 0236, replace the map sensor. Maybe it's known in other countries as the turbo boost pressure sensor. Maybe there's two things in the one unit. So, um, so it's a map and a turbo boost pressure sensor. I can't quite tell, but at least I replaced that and the car now runs as good as new. So 10 bucks and a brand new car. All right. Just thought I'd do a video on it. Um, I'll leave the stuff on the, um, I'll leave the links in the low bar for you, uh, on this, on this valve. Other than that, quick vid, replace your map sensor, 10 bucks. Hope this helps.